Sweet. I'm Gav and I'm from Sweet Design. Um, this week's video is uh, a review on the Parkside uh, Position Multi Grinder, sort of a multi tool um, from Lidl. I got this uh, a couple of weeks ago and I've, uh, I've done a couple of jobs with it. I have got one, but it's it was something a bit different which uh, in this which I'll explain and why I ended up getting it um, so it's my review on it <coughs> um, something a little bit different so hopefully you enjoy this so this is a multi grinder as I call it a multi grinder from uh, Parkside um, I call them multi-tool sort of thing. Uh, it cost me £19.99, which we got the big, the big extension. Um, so you get quite a bit, of, get quite a bit of uh, stuff in it. I'll just uh, put it down for you. So you get quite a bit of, uh, bit of stuff in it. You get, the, you get the old grinder, it's got a, got a good weight to it, it has got quite a good, good bit of weight so you know you've got something in it, you know you've got something when you're engraving and all that, you've got a maximum button there, that's your locking button so you can twist it so you can put your different bits in, um, <coughs> the cable, you've got one. So three meters, three meter cable, which I think's uh, really, really good for three meters. So you've got plenty of plenty of room. This is this is a bit which I were I were interested in. This is your extension pole. I can show you. You get your clamp, which is. As I say, it's a bit of plastic with just a bit of metal in. Um, not brilliant, right? But it's not. It's not really, really bad either. It's. Uh, I've had. Could have done with a better, better clamp. Could have done with, yeah. Could have done with a better clamp because it is a bit. It's a bit movy. It's a bit bolting there. It does move it about a bit. Um, it does clamp, it does clamp up. Just turn that. <coughs> so that's it clamped up. It, it is quite quite sturdy. This is uh, it's not very heavy. It's, it's a bit of plastic metal, but but what it's for? All it is is just. It's purposely just for the stand. That's spun off, doesn't it? Smells really good. So if I set that down a bit so you can see it, <coughs> you'll like your hook. Uh, you have your hook on your multi purpose tool. You can hook it up. Which is alright, but I mean, um, the downside which I got is sometimes with the vibration it lock it unlock this so uh, it slid down which is not not very good but see I meant to lock it I mean that it still pushes down a little bit you have to give it a bit of force with vibration it, it can come loose but it's not a massive, massive problem. Um, the clip on it, this clip is is a bit, it's a bit poor me really that. Um, you get, <coughs> get some nice uh, extras, you get some lamps, you get light. A little light, if you wanna, if you wanna engrave or use a multi-tool in there. Oh, oh, uh, 
get this bit which screws on. Then you can put your bit in. You put your bit in, you can set your depth as well. So you can use it like a, a mini router or if you want to do like signs engraving and you want to have more more control and more depth so obviously it's not a plunger out you'd have to cut it then plunge it down but you've got a you've got a window there I mean it's it's a bit sharp the plastic it's a bit it's a bit rough but I mean if you want to look you can see that if you if you're in a bit of a dark area it will be quite hard to see but other than that it, it is a good it's a good little bit of kit That just that just screws on. <coughs> you got that bit which just screws on as well, which I think is just a protector. You get some bits. But you get quite a few bits. You get like a little spanner, sanding wheels, grinders, uh, polishing bits. Um, I think this is a cutter. I think that's like a cutter sort of thing. You get. Uh, engraving. Get some uh, get the kit's pretty nice. Man. But don't forget I mean this this is a it's it's a twenty it's twenty quid nineteen pound ninety nine it's twenty quid it's it's there or there. Handles a bit. It's a bit of a separate thing so I mean I didn't buy it for the box. I mainly bought it for this because this I've got one and I've got a multi-tool uh, a different make and these are tw 20 I think they were about 20 20 30 or 40 between 20 and 40 quid just for this alone so I felt it, I wanted that straight away um, So this is just <coughs> just lock that. So hold the button, lock it down. It's got a hold of it, and that with a cap. So that just screws straight into it. There you go, you've got one massive, massive uh, bit of extension so you can use this like a pen. And that is the thing which I wanted it for so I could have more, you know, more flair with the engraving than have a machine in your hand. So I've got more. This. It, like I say it's between 20 and 40 quid I was looking at one from the other one so for 20 quid for the whole entire lot I thought we'll pretty much uh, have a go sort of thing for, for 20 quid it, it's worth a try so that's why I bought it um, with this one to lock it down to change your bits you can just pull that down To that I like this idea I like I like this where you've got more control over what you what you're engraving what you're outering uh, I'll leave a link below because I've I've already used this to do uh, a Star Wars coffee table I've engraved into Perspex with this uh, I had more control it took a bit more while because it's it's a smaller cutter but um, I'll leave a link below for that for that video but this is I've tried it out on that and I enjoyed it um, the downsides well the, up, the upsides is it costs you 20 quid 
and for that, that, that alone, that piece is, is, is well worth it. Like I say, you've got a little light, you've got other bits, you've got that. I mean, it's a little bit rough plastic, but a bit of a sandpaper, and you're sorted. And you've got a depth gauge on that, which is, I think, is brilliant. All these Parkside little bits are brilliant. Um, well worth 20 quid, you get a new get a new collar and everything in it, drill bits. For 20 quid, you can pay that just for bits like that, from, from like figure stores and stuff. The major downside is when I was routering with it, this collar, which I've masking taped it up, came off. <coughs> it split away from me. quite easily as it will vibrate it just comes away and it just left that spring and the bolt which as I was routering it, it I had to turn it off I mean this gets a little bit warm as well as you write as you engrave it but this is not I mean you've got your you've got like a bolt shape in there to lock so when it puts down locks it so that locks it in I mean that that just clips on and it just as you can see it's it's just a fail straight away but you can keep on spinning it or keep on clocking off like that for 20 quid <coughs> I can use some masking tape duct tape mm. stuff like that but I think if they'd have put the price up to like 25 or 30 quid but replace that with either a, a, an aluminium one I think it's still it'd have been worth it um, I think that bit really lets it down um, but if you want to use that without without this extension, it's a bob on bit of kit. It's like say you've got three meters of, of cable, and you've got your outer bit, so you could use it as a as a cheaper router. <coughs> Obviously, it's not going to put bigger cut bits in, but if you're doing smaller router and stuff, smaller signs and that, it's absolutely brilliant. Let's say boxes. It's just a. It's just a molded box sort of thing but the only thing I just do not like was this because when I was routing it it just that just flung off and as much as I tighten that if you keep on spinning it it'll come back open again and I think that that let it down but I mean I just I just put a bit of masking tape put a bit of glue on it but I just didn't want to put glue on it because just in case you need to get into that spring or for that bolt but I think if if they'd have made that aluminium so with, with because it does get it does get warm obviously with friction it, it does get warm but I think if they'd have made that aluminium or bit stronger plastic or something like that, you know, something a bit more durable, it'd have been, it'd have been brilliant, and that is the only thing that lets it down, is this piece, obviously, you're holding it, and it just, and it just, with the vibration it came away while I, while I was doing a piece of work, but like I say, for 20 quid, or £9.99, it is brilliant. So it's just that, that piece there, but that's why I keep on saying, if it would have been 25, 30 quid, it wouldn't have been worth it, but for 20 quid, but I think they could have invested a little bit more, and put that, <coughs> and done that, aluminium, and it would have made it, it would have made it look, a lot nicer and it had, like I say if it had been 25 quid with that it's still still no money really for, for, 
full one. But yeah, that's. Other than that, I don't, it is a nice bit of kit. I can do some signs. I can do some other engravings. Like I say, I'll leave a link below for my Star Wars table and that. Um, um, but yeah, hopefully you enjoy. Uh, hopefully you enjoyed this review. Hopefully it's something you might want to buy yourself, or you might not want to buy. Um, if anybody else. But yeah, that's that's just purely my thoughts on it. I'm not I'm not paid by them. I'm not. It's just my thoughts on on a tool which I bought myself uh, to do some to do some work with, and that was my thought and just my the good the good sides to it and also the downsides to it. It's, that lets it down. Other than that though, it is, a, it is a pretty good tool. Thank you very much for watching. Please like, please subscribe, please share. <coughs> um, if you ring that little bell on, on end, uh, I get a video up every week. Yeah, this isn't, uh, obviously this is not a making video. I haven't made out, it's just a review, but um, I thought I'd throw a couple of reviews in some tools which I, I pick up or I, I like and I think I'm going to try all, all pieces of equipment or anything if, if, if I thought I'd do a review on see how see how they go. Hopefully, uh, hopefully you like it. Hopefully, if you pick up one and you, you enjoy it and you make some up, good, good. I'm glad. Um, thanks for watching. See you later. Bye.